will we and today I will be showing you how to have custom server messages inside of your Roblox game jam. So let's get into this. First things first, open up starter player here and in starter player scripts click the plus and add in a local script. Inside of that local script, just copy and paste the pin comment down below. And let me explain what this does. So here is basically defining like it's going to be a message in chat. Then here it started UI as it is a GUI. Chat makes system messages. It basically means there will be a message that you choose randomly because random. That is said by the system that comes out in chat. Then here message color. I'm just going to add mine white, so 255, 255, 255. You can find on a website the color for it. You can find it on the dev forum. Just search up Roblox RGB color numbers or something like that. And then hit enum.font. This has a red line. I wonder why. Well, we actually need to put a font because it's waiting for us to pick a font. So put any font you want. As soon as you type, it will come up with some... I really like cartoon, but it's up to you. Find something that stands out. I might do sci-fi. What I'm gonna do though is arcade, just because I think it might look nicer because it will stick out. Then here will be the final part you actually need to change. You just need to add messages. If you just want one message, then just put in one message. But what this will do is, it will just pick one random message, which could mean it's the same message more than once. For example, it for example, you can have a message saying, This game is in early beta. What the game is right now will not be what it is by this time next week, or something like that. That could be said twice in a row if you've got, let's say, three other messages because it's random. So I'm gonna put in a few messages. I'll see you after that. Also guys, to add a second one, after your speech marks, add a comma, then open up your speech marks again. Okay, so I put down some different text. Also, it will say wait five minutes. This is how long between each message. I wouldn't have it five seconds. I'd say maybe five minutes or something. So if you're not sure what that is, just times it by 60. Or just get up a calculator, then times it by 60 for how many minutes you want. I'm going to be doing 5 seconds for the purpose of this video, just so you guys can see it changing. So, I'm going to hop on base plate and click play so you guys can see what happens. Okay, so I open up chat. There we go, in the font we want as well. If you are enjoying this game, make sure to leave a like and favourite it. If you experience any bugs, please just message me so I can fix them. So yeah, as you guys can see, it is working. And the reason why I say don't have it on this quick is because it could annoy the players in your game. And also, someone could just be trying to have a conversation with a friend. And then you have one nice big announcement. Just floods the chat. Also, if you guys have an announcement, like servers will be restarting soon. Just either make it so it's the only message there. Or just take away this random part. But if you enjoyed this video or found it helpful in any way, then please leave a like so YouTube recommends this video to more people so more people can find use out of it. And also, I would really appreciate it if you were to just scroll down under this video and have a look at that beautiful subscribe button. If it says subscribe and not subscribed, then maybe consider clicking it. Worst case scenario, you can always unsubscribe at a later date. But until next time, keep scripting, keep developing. Bye, guys!